on OnlyFans, like you have to be full throttle, like a proper dirty slot. Like mm-hmm. someone's going to pay you a couple hundred to fuck yourself with a dildo. Like you're going to do it. Yeah. But then why are you, sm- <laughs> why are you smirking? I'm just thinking about fucking myself with a dildo. <laughs> Hey, I'm Xander. Hi, I'm Jay, and welcome to my BF on, on OS. OS. <laughs> Which means my boyfriend is on OnlyFans, in ah. case you didn't know. <laughs> so, how are you feeling? Yeah, I'm. I'm intrigued. We're not really used to recording just our voices, are we? And we've got clothes on. Or do we? You wouldn't know, would you? <laughs> It's weird though, I'm just like staring into your eyes and I want to look into the distance. Well, that's quite intimate, isn't it? Well, we're that kind of couple, well, we should mention we're a couple, right? Yeah, there we are. That if we're going for dinner, we'd sit beside each other. That's more of a you thing, though, I feel like. Oh yeah, I don't like sitting across from people. No, you don't. So, should we go right back to when we started? Well, yeah, everyone knows OnlyFans, but people don't really know what it is, I don't believe. Yeah, I don't think people know, like, the industry secrets. Can we call them? Can we call it that? Industry secrets? I mean, I don't even feel like we know, but we just... We know more than most people. How did you get started then on OnlyFans? Well, I feel like it was because we were watching TV and we saw an advert for this show. It was about cam models, wasn't it? Webcam models. Webcam models. And in that show that we watched, it was... They were talking about... OnlyFans, and we were like, what is OnlyFans? We'd never heard of it. Yeah. I think we were just intrigued, weren't we? We were like, what is this website where you can apparently upload pictures of yourself and get paid for it? People will subscribe. And, and they kept talking about they were making good money or decent yeah, money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was, and we were, our eyes just went like, bing. Yeah. Because we were living in London, which <laughs> yeah. is and we did very money, expensive. Yeah, and that, yeah. And so I started uploading on Twitter. Mm-hmm. And I think I must have just uploaded or started interacting with other gay creators that had OnlyFans. Mm -hmm. And this one guy in particular, a German guy, who was big in... Oh, I remember this. Yeah. So... This German guy with a (laughs) massive (laughs) cock. (laughs) And it really was big. It was massive. Yeah. And he... he, I think he must have... He must have sent me a message and he was like, oh, I noticed you were... You were uploading. I mean, this is what you... This is... I can help you out. Like, we can do retweets, which means it will get seen by more people. And I think, like... I must have posted a couple of things and it just kind of blew up. Mm. And he was helping He was helping me out. He was like, yeah, he was... Well, I, I think he'd ulterior motives, though, this guy. Well, maybe he did. I, mean, I, I, think he where... fanc- I think he wanted to see the goods. And Do you know I think that's just your jealous No, boyfriend, this was his way of getting, getting into it. But I remember we had a conversation where we were like, we were sending photos and nudes to people or each other <laughs> anyway. And we were like, well, why... If you can make money from it, why not do that? Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. We were good at it. And at the time, he was he was doing well. Okay, but let's not forget, it was just me. Remember, so it was only. Oh me. yeah, yeah, I know. And this must have happened. This must have went on for about a year, maybe a little bit more. Because at this point, we'd have been a couple for what three, four years. Yeah, something like that. And we were quite a closed couple, especially by gay standards. Yeah, yeah, we were, and we and we would get somewhat jealous of attention yeah if it was attention on you or intention on attention on me so it went from that to you suddenly showing your <laughs> the world rock hard cock on twitter to anyone who wanted to see it <laughs> which i think i think that was the thing because the money the money started coming in but you were wrestling with the yeah. fact that like it was going well but at the same time you I, your boyfriend was being seen by all these guys and at that time it looked like as well you I were guess single. I was single because I was like presenting. That, the as, German guy had told you to present as bi, yeah, and as single. But let's not forget as well, though. You were also pursuing other things at that yeah, time I yourself. Was, yeah, I was busy doing other stuff. But I remember he had sent you like an example of what he wanted you to do because he knew what what worked on Twitter to get the retweets and the like, uh-huh. like to build up your. He was just trying to help. I know, <laughs> no, I know, but. And it was that thing where you were like, well, I'm, I'm going to have to do these certain photos yeah. or videos. Uh-huh. And I remember in the tiny bed set in London that you went off into the bathroom, <laughs> which was basically a cupboard with the sliding door. And I was sitting on the couch. Just like, waiting oh. for me to be done. Well, yeah, you were like, I'm going off to do my photos now. And I was like, OK. Without me? <laughs> yeah, because before that, it would always be... It was kind of taboo for one of us to go away yeah, and you like wouldn't, You jerk. wouldn't announce, yeah. oh, I'm going off for a wank in the toilet. To and take photos of myself or, that are going sh- uh, to show to everyone. And know? it was very specific about what you had to do and show. And 
yeah. the angles that he wanted that he thought would do well on Twitter. It was. And then I remember I went up to the sliding door and I opened it and I was like, are you done? Are you done? You're like, no, I'm not even started. And I think we had a bit of an argument because I was like, well, this is just weird. You're in there doing that. And I'm just sitting on the couch watching Emmerdale. Yeah. And it's funny at the time I was, I didn't really get it because I guess I was the one doing it. I kind of, I just kept thinking like, oh, he's and you really, loved the attention. I was like, you? he's really annoying. Like he won't just leave me alone. Like leave me to it. But I get it. I get from your, yeah. from your appeal, like your point of view, like that, that must have been hard to come to terms with. And I, I was also thinking though, like how would that affect me and our relationship? Yeah. And then or what would other people think? Yeah, if they other found people that? Would see I, it. I know. No, that that definitely was an aspect that we had to. But then the money started rolling in. Yeah, but then you care. also, I think, you, I think <laughs> you also started enjoying, like, helping me out. I mean, yeah. in, 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 in the all sense of the word. Like, you were, like, you were good at, like, I think this is Coming why, up with ideas. Yeah, and, yeah you were really good at that. And I was, I was hopeless. Like, I was just, I think that's me. I'm the hopeless Well, that's the interesting thing about like it the because model. I think everyone, well, most people send notes, mm -hmm. especially gay guys. It's like you send photos of your dick or whatever, but there's a difference between sending a dick on Snapchat to yeah. taking a photo for your OnlyFans page. But do you not, do you remember like when you first started, like that first few weeks or the first month, like what was it like? I just remember not being able to believe that someone would actually pay to see that. Like I just remember there would be, I would be looking, I'd be checking all the time the notifications that would be coming through and I'd be like, oh, so-and-so subscribe. I was like, subscribed they're actually they're actually doing it they're actually joining my page and like interacting with that i thought it was i, f I found it unbelievable so is that how it worked so you did that content that he, this german guy had asked for yeah and what he posted that on his twitter no 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 so he would retweet it that and brought it, people to your twitter which would then yeah they would, and then they would click the link and go through to the only fans like yeah. they'd find out i'd have the only fans and with that you even saying that is that still still in my mind like uh -huh. people would pay to see one single person on a website yeah when there's a lot of free porn like you can literally go on Pornhub and search whatever you want that's true i think people like that intimate experience though like that one-on-one -on -one. like they think i mean they are they're interacting with you and it's do you think that's the big part of it then it's they're getting to talk to you yeah as much as seeing you yeah and they they it's it's more i mean that is more intimate isn't it like you're not it's not a faceless it's not a not a faceless it's not like a some unknown person behind the camera. It's, it's like you're actually interacting with them. They've got a name, they've got a life, like. Yeah. So if it hadn't blew up and took off and you didn't like do well on Twitter, hmm. do you think you wouldn't have continued? Probably not, because I think if it didn't gain the momentum that it gained, I probably would have just thought like, this isn't worth it. This isn't worth me doing this. Yeah. But I mean, I do think as well, that speaks to me as a person. I think I did, I think I do enjoy people seeing and people well, that's judging the thing. me in that way this is what we it, always it talk about it kind of turns me on like. yeah we're horny people and yeah i think we do like showing off and getting that attention yeah no we we must it's it's in it's inside of us literally <laughs> and figuratively <laughs> no but i think there was a real pivotal moment because before you, you had a different username mm -hmm. and then this image it maybe wasn't oh as much God, you. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Now I'm now I'm having flashbacks. <laughs> now I'm like we're really actually remembering no, I, it. I remember well. What was my name? It was your curious crush. Oh my God! So it was. <laughs> that is the thing that I forgot. Like but I, I think I, that I started and then it, it then it kind of teetered off and it was becoming it started becoming more work than enjoyable. I think like six months in or eight months yeah. in. Yeah. And I I think I must I think I kind of quit like I semi quit didn't I like a. Like I kind of thought, oh, this isn't going well, and then I went away. I think for a couple of weeks, mm. and I was like, no, 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 I want to come back and, and. But I think what happened, if I'm right, is you weren't enjoying portraying being someone you weren't. Mm. Like you were this curious bi person, which you weren't. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And I was like just finding my way with guys, uh, and, and you and, were and, trying to be like this scally kind of lad, like this little chavy person. Yeah. Or Neddy, fuck boy, <laughs> which isn't really you. No. And so I thought to myself, like, yeah, I better rebrand this. You rebrand, which is when more. you took charge and said, fuck the German guy, basically. Yeah. Not fuck Not the German literally, guy. No. I mean, I feel like we had this so many little stories in the oh, yeah. first year or two years that. Well, I think it, was it, it did just cause a lot of friction. It. No, it did. And uh, we would always meet people and it would 
because people always ask, oh, what do you do? Especially yeah. if you're living in London, they're curious, well, how are you living here? How do you afford it? Yeah. And we'd maybe skirt around the truth or tell the truth. Yeah. And then it would always come back to me or friends that I had at the time. And, well, how do you feel about your boyfriend? Yeah. Your BF being on OF <laughs> or having an OF. And I, Can yeah. you remember back to that time when it was just me doing it? Do you feel like it did really affect you? Yeah, and I, I felt like it was... Like, I don't know if we were getting on or having sex or wanking mm-hmm. together or whatever. It did start to feel like, oh, well, you know, he's been... Did filmed. you feel like I was be- oh, I was being shared? Like, it, was, it wasn't just... I wasn't just yours anymore. That's what it is. Yeah, it? yeah. It's like you're, mm-hmm. you belong on the internet. Yeah. But then it's like it's a character, isn't it? It's yeah. like a, a version of you. It's not really you. Yeah. It's how, I think it's how we but I d- perceive I, sex, isn't it? Yeah. And, and, and that whole... But it definitely affects your intimacy. on Because you... On OnlyFans, like you have to be full throttle, like a proper dirty slot. Like mm-hmm. someone's going to pay you a couple hundred to fuck yourself with a dildo. Like you're going to do it. Yeah. But then why are you <laughs> why are you smirking? I'm just thinking about fucking myself with a dildo. <laughs> <laughs> but I'd never be like on a Thursday night, like oh go fuck yourself with a dildo. I want to watch. But if someone's on OnlyFans paying you, you, you I remember you might that. Do it. That's what I remember as well. I remember when it was me making content alone. I would do the content and then it, it would, I would like finish and I'd come back to you and you'd be like, right, so let's look at the content. <laughs> you'd be like yeah. watching it back and you'd be like, wait, so... Or I'd be, I think I was confused in my mind about what was going on because I would be like, I'd be turned on and horny about the fact that you're like wanking. I or... remember that as well on top of that. So be, I, at the end, I'd would... always come in and be like, oh, like, like trying to initiate something. You're like, <laughs> no, I've just... Cause you, and you kept no, saying, well, I... that's work. And I was like, fuck off. I want to... I remember as well that would be like, I would, I would make the video jerking off and coming and then it, I'd come out and I'd be like, so what have you been up to? And you're like, oh, well, I was just jerking off as well. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, well, why have you got to do it when I'm doing it? Because what I'm doing is for money, it's for work. And you, you're just doing it because you want to like get even. You're like, well, I'll just jerk off too. <laughs> and then I remember I started subscribing to people on OnlyFans that we were seeing. Uh-huh. Was for as market uh, research market to see like what you <laughs> should be doing. But really, I was just like looking to see their goods and right. their, them what videos they were doing. But I think that did help because that informed me, which then I could inform you. Yeah, of course. <laughs> yeah, so I think we should wrap it there, and because we're gonna get more into it next time. Aren't There's we? so much innuendo here. <laughs> wrapping it, getting into it next time. Are you getting all hot and bothered? <laughs> I need to go and take a cold shower. <laughs> okay, so yeah, bye. Yeah, see you later.